Welcome to this video on the states of matter. Take a look at the keywords we use in this video. So there are three states of matter. Solids have a fixed lattice, which means they have a set shape or pattern. They have very strong forces of attraction, meaning the particles are attracted to each other lots. They have a low amount of energy, meaning the particles can only vibrate and slightly move. The next state is liquid. Liquids have a random arrangement, so the particles have no fixed shape. They can feel the shape of any container. They are beginning to overcome the forces of attraction, so they have more energy to be able to flow and move around a bit more. The last state is a gas. Gases have no set shape and have very low forces of attraction. They have the most amount of energy, so they are completely free moving and not touching. So anything can exist in any state as long as it is under the right conditions, so the right temperature or the right pressure. The state change between a solid and liquid is called melting, and then between a liquid and gas is called boiling. To go back from a gas to a liquid it's called condensing, and to go from a liquid to a solid it's called freezing. Freezing doesn't just mean below zero degrees, it's anything that has gone from a liquid to a solid, so technically any object in your house is frozen. An example of state changes would be ice melting into water, and then boiling into steam. To change state we need to give the substance energy, so we can heat it. As we heat a solid it gains energy. The particles begin to vibrate quicker. As it begins to melt the temperature stays constant as the energy is being used to change state. If we then continue to heat it, the liquid then continues to gain more energy, and the process repeats as the liquid turns into a gas.